Ever since I was nine years old, I knew I wanted to design products for athletes. I was a Title IX athlete and I played soccer and the uniforms that we wore were made for boys. Living so close to New York City, I was really curious about why this huge fashion industry that supported women, why it couldn't support female athletes. I wanted to change that. My desire for more inclusive design led me to a career in the sports industry for more than 20 years, culminating in a position as innovation director of apparel at Nike. Coming to the University of Oregon and working in the college design really gives me a platform to research what I'm passionate about. I teach students how to develop performance footwear, apparel, and equipment through an inclusive design perspective. There are two things that are happening in the marketplace. There's what the sports industry calls a shrink and pink, where we'll take men's products and recolor them and make them smaller and call them women's. And then there's true performance product where we are actually looking at the science behind the female body and applying it to product. And that's really where you know, there hasn't been a lot of work. The problem is when we create products for just men, it's leaving out other users because we're not considering the different dimensions of the body. For example, I work with female firefighters, and we're just recently going through a data set around gloves. They told us that they took their gloves off during a fire because they could not feel the product, the hose, they couldn't turn knobs because the gloves were too big. What we have found is that in all areas of the product that female firefighters wear, there are opportunities for improvement. As a nine-year-old, I had such high aspirations to work at a very large sports company and to really influence products for women. And I feel that I, I've done that, but I feel like there's more. There's more that I can do at the university. There's other areas that I can influence. And every day, you know, the opportunities are there to do better. Like the back 